Boom. Boom, baby. What? What? I miss our intro music. We need to like hire someone to make us some intro music. You know, we might be doing that. I was looking at that today. <laughs> so, do they do that on Fiverr? Yes, they do. I, I, accident, I accidentally found him, but I was like, he is bookmarked on my phone for uh, just for that purpose. Might get us some specialized intro music. We're coming along just very slowly, very slowly. <laughs> yes, that'd be fucking awesome. What the fuck yeah, boobs at? I think I like that. That's going to be a new uh, slogan. <laughs> Hello. Uh, Hello, people out there in the world. Hola. It is the. Oh, uh, hi, hi. Oh, you want to do this? I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. Go, go ahead. Take, right, so it is the eighth day of the month of March. So if you get that, it's March 8th. This is uh, Gamer Girls Radio. And we are doing Pixinista like we do every Tuesday night. This time, every Tuesday. We also have a show on Thursday, same time. Got to check this out. Kind of awesome. Um, and right that is it. over there. It's Miss Corey. We love her very much. She's amazing. Mm-hmm. And then I'm Jen, and I fucking rock. So, yay! God damn right. Did you know today? Today is International Women's Day. I know, right? So, guys, (laughs) you better do it right. (laughs) Bow down, bitches. Bow down, bitches. Mm -hmm. Fuck yeah. Pull up and Beyonce. Bow down, bitches. Oh, my God. So much Twitter love today. I'm sorry, y'all. I didn't even see this. Um, I'm in... Knee deep in some work. Hello. I've been slacking on Twitter. I need to get back over to yeah. Twitter. Yeah. Yes, I have no choice. Uh, <laughs> all day. But hello to you, Crystal and GTA Money Ch- and Ms. I oh, Zombie Kittens. Corey, and, I think that storm is trying to get you. Am I am I sounding gladiosi? You're not gladiosi, but you be like saying a word and you're like, yeah, nothing. Ooh, it's just ooh. out and in and out and in and it is, yeah, it is coming for me. Oh, uh, no. Well, if we go down, folks, we're sorry. You'll have to come see us Thursday night because these storms are no joke right now. Yeah, they are not. Uh, oh, my God. They're all over you, Corey. Hey, Corey. I'm here. Are you there? <laughs> Okay, well, I'm going to let, let, okay, she, she's there. All right, I'm going to go ahead and jump in and do something. Maybe she'll come back. Because I can't hear you off and on, Corey, so. <laughs> oh, no, poor Corey, don't cry. Okay, so I saw this on Facebook the other night. And, you know, I usually don't click on Uh-oh. ads on Facebook because fuck you, Facebook. But I had to click on this. <laughs> this is from a company called Leaf. And uh, they're creating Oh, I've jewelry. seen that. I've seen that. I know, right? So awesome. So this jewelry has four main features. SOS, safer walk, which we've talked about before. So say you're a girl, you're walking at night. You can show where your route is supposed to be. And then you ask for guardians, your friends, but not to watch you on their phones or their computers, whatnot. And if they see you go off the trail or stay in one place for too long, they can actually call the cops and tell them exactly where you are. GPS, everything. Uh, so, so that's really cool. It also has notifications. So it lets you know if you've got a message on your phone. And it'll also do the selfie thing. So, you know, it'll set up with your phone. You squeeze your necklace. It'll take a epic selfie of you. The, is, this the one, is this the one from the guys in uh, overseas or is this an American version? <laughs> uh, I think these guys are all here in the U.S. But it was created with uh, the women in India in mind because they were all Indian. Yeah, because I, I saw that and they said that... Uh, they said, oh, I forgot what I was going to say. Never mind. I've been drinking. And the, the girl who was raped last year and left to die, pretty much, she was from one of the guy's neighbors, n- neighborhoods. Or, yes, I remember so, him. So I do remember him saying that. Yeah, it, it hit really close to home. So he and his friends decided, all right, we've got to do something. We've got to do something to change this, to help these women, to keep them safe. And, of course, apparently they have gotten some backlash because why is it men that are making this? No, fuck you. I don't care if it's a guy or a girl who's making this. The point is someone is making this. This is a human issue. It doesn't. I don't care if he has a penis or not that he's making this. Well, you know how I feel about that. Some of you girls out there, it is, it, in this instance, it really does not matter uh, who made it. Just make sure you get yourself one so you're safe. Because, uh, mm-hmm. oh, that's what he was saying. He said it was uh, they did it for women in India because women in India still wear a lot of jewelry. I remember him yes. saying that. Yes, 
Yes. <laughs> so it's really good for them because they like yes. to wear jewelry. Uh, I do not wear jewelry, but I would probably put this on. This I, I, I'm totally thing. thinking about ordering one. I really am. So it, it's called Safer, and it works with Bluetooth low energy. It's got a seven-day battery backup. It charges in just 15 minutes, folks. Just 15. So take it off while you're brushing your teeth, doing your hair, put it back on. It's ready to go. It's yeah, I like that. It's a buzzer, uh, rechargeable with micro USB, and two color variations. Actually, it looks like here on their website they have three now. But this is the only one they have for sale right now, this, this necklace. Uh, because I was actually looking at, these are the guys who made it. And oh, nice. Yeah, and these are the three colors. And I was actually looking, they had a link, was it here? Somewhere that I was looking at it the other day. They were actually showing other concept jewelry that they're working on. Oh, here it is. Let me let me get this pulled up. Yeah, they are in India, so it's free shipping in India. Yes, yes. So they, they've got bracelets. That these are concept <laughs> things. Oh, I like the bracelets a lot. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Um, they've got these other necklaces and uh, belly chains. These are also bracelets. So different types of bracelets, all of that fun stuff. Oh, maybe these are accessories. I was clicking on these yesterday, so maybe. I really it. like those. Really, really like those. The bracelets maybe. are really I nice. No, right? Those bracelets. And I'm trying to, oh, I, hold on. I want to see the Orion. Does it open up? Can I buy it? Because it didn't look like I could purchase this. See, I see buy now at the top. The top, yeah. No, it just takes me right back here to this jewelry. Well, I guess can you add it to the cart? That's actually a not a bad price considering for your safety. You know, for sa safe wise. Yeah, th there you go. Eighty five dollars yeah, yeah. for ship with you know with the shipping. Uh huh. But that's but that's just the pendant. That's you can't seem to buy the accessories yet. Oh, well, y'all get yeah, on so, that so, because, yeah, because I want that. I'd be all over this. That maze one? That maze one? Yeah, that is what I'm talking about. I love me a bracelet. Yes, I love me a bracelet. I keep, I always usually keep a bracelet on me, so that would be right up my alley. And I really hmm. like the astral one. That is very pretty. I like it has a matching life. necklace. Weird. It's even got covers, so you can protect it. See, I like this, uh, and, and I, I like it because I would use it in, I'm sure it's going to have an app. It can be used in conjunction. Ladies, get all your, get everything you can on you to make sure, you know, if they take your phone, you got your leaf. If they take your leaf, you got your phone, your 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 uh, your watch, get you an Android or an I mean, look Apple at, watch. Who would steal this from you? The, the, these look like fake, like you buy them in the store, five bucks, you know, at the little... Well, yeah, here, here's, well, you know how I am. I'm thinking along the lines of if men start to figure out what it is and they snatch it off your That's neck, true. you still need to have, you're going to have other stuff, get, you know, get all of it, get the bracelet, make them where they have to, they got to really just get stuff off of oh, you. Yeah. <laughs> you're going to get to something before they can take it off of you. Just say, yeah, it. because the bracelet, you wouldn't really even think twice about it. Yeah, that one is, it kind of is, I really like them. Who designed the bracelets? I like the necklaces. They're okay, but I really like the bracelets. Really, really like them. Well, they, they now have 12 people, I want to say, on their team. Yes, yeah, somebody's got works. a nice yeah. design eye. I, I could see those bracelets in a, in a Vogue magazine, y'all. I'm just telling you. Mm -hmm. See, she's even wearing one of them. Actually, all the girls are wearing as well, they should be. Guys, you should throw one on too. I don't think this is just be a girl thing. Guys no, have been no, no, raped, attacked, or beaten. So maybe make some for the guys. So maybe the bracelets will work for guys if they, you know, mm -hmm. well, I think they, no, they look kind of unisex to me. I know some guys that will wear those bracelets. Yeah, yeah. No, it, you, and I hadn't even thought about that, Corey, but that's actually a brilliant idea. I mean, you're right. This sort of thing is not just a female issue. I mean, men, as much as, you know, we don't talk about it. Men get raped too. Men get in bad situations. Attacks, so, beat over the head, yeah, somebody's yeah. trying to steal. If, if they don't rape you, they do stuff to you too. Horrible things to you all too. Mm -hmm. So I think this is a really, an, a, you know, I can where it came from was for women, but it's really great. I think yeah. uh, this would probably do really well on college campuses quite a lot, uh, especially some of you guys. I think y'all get it really bad in college. You know, somebody's beating you over the head or mm -hmm. something on the way to now, the car. Say, I read somewhere that it had a panic button type thing so that it would automatically alert authorities. Yeah, it's, it's almost like, it, it sounds like a, the panic button app, but it's just in jewelry. And I like that it's in the jewelry because it's going to be quicker for mm -hmm. you to get to. Usually if somebody attacks you, they're probably going to knock the phone out of your hand. So, you know, bam, 
um, you know, you can probably reach up and grab your necklace right after that happens and then press it. Uh, that's very nice. I would like to see it, it add some of the features that Panic Button has, which means as soon as you press it, not only does it take a selfie, but it starts to record and record. I think they, I know it sends out the GPS coordinates, but I'd like it to record some sound. Yes. Oh, you that know? would be awesome. Yes. <laughs> yes. So you can do kind of a, like a, what's uh, the movie Everybody Likes Taken, where he tells her to yell out the description of what the person looks like. Mm -hmm. You could very well do that if it just record, records some sound. This is just a really good idea that is long overdue. Yes, yes, long overdue. And this is, this is really cool. I kind of want one of these. I may have to get one of these because... You and me both, I'm thinking, I need one, and teenager yeah, definitely yeah, needs one. Me and the other half, we go walking a lot of times at night because we enjoy that, but, yeah. Yeah, and you live in yeah. Texas, and walking at night is the only time you can assure that you do not have a heat stroke most of the time. <laughs> True mother trucking story. Oh, my God. Heat stroke. Oh, passing out. That's why I do it that. Is no joke, man. No joke. Oh, God. Who, where, I don't know where all you people are coming from. Hello, Controller Junkie Squad. Thank you. Welcome to our Twitter lives. Hello. 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 And Josh and Steven. I need a link. You didn't give me no link. Who, me? Yes, I need the link to the YouTube. Oh, I didn't give you a linky, a YouTube link? Uh, mm -mm. I have to give you a YouTube linky. Yes, I need the YouTube linky. Uh, I, I think I have our gaming thing open. I'm still, yeah, Google, I'm going to need y'all to calm down a little bit. I'm kind of confused about what's going on. <laughs> I'm kind of confused how this thing, this gaming channel works, but I'm going to figure it out. Uh, and did you know they came out with a new version of OBS? I cannot figure out how to work that shit. Somebody in this good with the new OBS, go ahead and give sister a shout because, yeah, I'm confused. Um, very confused. Um, and I got stuff I need to say. I need to get off my chest and whatnot. All right. Uh, I got some well, you know what? I'm going to do this, but it's kind of old, uh, especially for people who are on YouTube a lot. Since we're talking about this, I'm going to uh, kind of segue into this just really quickly. Uh, one of our favorite YouTubers in my house is uh, Matthew Santoro. Have you ever watched his videos, Ginger? I have not. At least I don't think I have. Well, he does kind of educational but humorous videos. Like he does top 10, you know, uh, craziest prison escapes, you know, stuff like that. Um, and you know, I love, you know, useless facts. They'll never, you know, maybe I'll be on Jeopardy one day. But in any case, um, we, you've heard us talk about uh, Nicole Arbor, the one that did the fat people shaming video. And mm -hmm. her, her boyfriend was other famous YouTuber, Matthew Santoro, who we adore. Um, he posted this a couple of months ago uh, that he was abused by Nicole. <gasps> that, she, that he, if you if you can see my screen there, let me present it. Um, and he, he he accidentally made the video public. It was supposed to be private, but people gave him such a positive response. Um, this is kind of what we were talking about. Men, sometimes you are a victim of abuse, um, and, and I know you can't talk about it because we're expected to be strong. And I know this is a weird thing to talk about on International Women's Day, but this is where we'll turn the tables a little bit. Us women are telling you if you're in a, in a relationship with a woman that is abusing you, uh, please go. Um, and, I, and in a lot of ways, I think it's uh, it may be a little bit worse for them because they can't, you can't hit a woman back. You know, you can't really fight back. You kind of uh, feel, and you may feel like you have to take the abuse, but you don't. Just leave. Just pick up your stuff and go. Um, it's not like she can physically stop you. Go. Um, and so anyway, he put up a, a video. Talk, can you still hear me? Yeah, I can still hear you. I'm sorry. Yeah. I was actually like reading the article. Oh, you were reading? I'm sorry. I'm like, I can't I just scroll. Oh, yeah, you're trying to figure out how to scroll. Uh, yeah, but no, this is a troll. She is, now she posted and said she didn't do any of that stuff. But I, I love Matt, but I don't think he's that great of an actor where he would pull this off because he's crying. As you can see there, that is a, you know, kind of a screen grab where he's actually crying. Um, you know, it, you know what makes me think that she did do this, even though she's saying she didn't. She said somebody said she said uh, so not somebody, but somewhere uh, uh, in the videos, videos she's taking them down. In the comments, supposedly she said something about the little bitch that I broke up with. Says that I did something with him, uh, or I hit him. Uh, here it is. I heard the little bitch I dumped months ago is still trying to use me to get attention on his vlog channel. Ew. Um, he didn't mention her by name. Now we all knew if you watch 
you know, who he was dating. But still, he was, he and he hasn't said anything. People have left comments on his videos. I saw them, and he earned a tremendous amount of respect because if this was any other guy other than him, they would have just been talking all kinds of bad about her. They'd have called her fat, just, you know, all kinds of whatever. Uh, he said not a word other than this, and it was all about, you know, him being abu abused. Um, and, Nicole, that's not, that's not nice. No, but like yeah, as I'm reading this, my heart goes out to him because this does happen just as much with men as it does with women. You know, some of you women think you can, you can control your men. You can change them. That you can just totally ride them like, oh, my God. No, you are supposed to be partners. You can't, you can't do that. I mean, fuck if you. And this is her, by the way. Yeah. See, and this was the two of them. I, I noticed the change in him. And I don't even know, you know, I don't know him personally. I hope to meet him one day. Teenatrix says, I'm allowed to only date him and Chris Hardwick, but Chris Hardwick announced that he was engaged, so I cannot have him. Aww. So <laughs> th that's all. This, those only two approved people that I can date. So, um, but I didn't even know him, but I noticed that he stopped posting videos because he does like two a week. And it was like two, three weeks go by. Remember I told you I'm on Sunday. I like, I got to watch my Matthew Santoro. It's Sunday. And it was like, there is no video for like three weeks. What is going on? Mm -hmm. uh, and I, you know, I noticed, and that was, he's not like that. He's very much like Ginger and I. It's like, I got to get my hustle on. I got work to do. I got stuff to do. Um, you know, oh, joke. I got, I got shit to do. And I didn't see him and I knew something was up and all this was going on in the background. And he threw up a video and he wasn't acting like himself in the videos. It was like forced, you know, he, cause he's really funny, but it sounded kind of forced funny. And I was like, this, oh, man. Is, are you whipped? But you know, it wasn't whipped. It was this is going on. This is going on. Um, so if you get a chance to go over and watch it, if you're a guy out there that's having an issue with your girlfriend or significant other where you might be being abused, and we're not talking about the kind of some of you like to be abused. If you like it, stay, you know. But I'm saying if you don't, <laughs> please get out. You're an yeah. adult. You're yeah. supposed to be an equal partner. You're not there. You're not their slave. You're not their child. You're not their little dolly to dress up and be told where to go, who to talk to, and what to do. No. And anybody that truly loves you is not going to try to cut you off from other people. Exactly. They just the big, big oh. include both situations. If it's with a man, they start trying to cut to tell you this shit ain't. Corey, you're right. cutting out again. I know, I know. Oh no. Poor Cory. Poor Cory. Oh. All right, so oh. we all what to wear and how to wear it and how to pair stuff together. And a lot of you I've seen are wearing a lot of more Star Wars stuff. A lot more. A lot more Star Wars stuff recently. And then the nerdy, you know, tight hipster jeans are in. So let me go ahead and pull this up. This is uh, from Pinterest. It's how to wear Star Wars style. And I'm really, really, really liking this. Hold on. I like the shoes. Is it showing? There we go. All right. So. Oh, we nice. You can probably, I'm betting you can probably find this shirt either at um, Target. Target. Okay. Yeah, yeah. we have this shirt. <laughs> so these, these sneakers can be found at any shoe store. Chuck Taylors. Uh huh. This can be found at your local Walmart, your local Target. Na Old Navy too. Old Navy too. Same thing with these jeans. Um, you can get these glasses just about anywhere. Yeah. <laughs> just make sure that you're not wearing them with prescription that you can't or you should <laughs> be looking at. I yeah. saw someone doing that the other day. I was like, what? What's the point? Um, and I like this. I, I like the coffee mug. I want. See now, this whole outfit is me, except for I would probably throw some heels or a nice uh, booty because I like to wear uh, heels with stuff like this. It it makes mm -hmm. it something makes it a different look. So I heels, and then I'd have on the lovely leaf bracelet. <laughs> now, see, this would totally be my style, except not so much these because I like to go hiking and walking. I would go with regular tennis shoes because yeah, because those are kill you. They have no art support yeah, no, whatsoever. No, no, Th those are just for if you know you're going out and you're not it's gonna be going off trail somewhere. Sure, wear those, I can't but. wear them at all. I'm one of those people that has that ultra arch in the foot. Like I was yes. born to be a ballerina, so yes. no, 
no, I can't. I have to have. Yes. No, I, I have a low arch, so I need the, the arch support. So. I need. Are... But I throw me some heels on with that work. That's that's nice. That's right, nice. But this is actually com coming from Polyvore, and I hadn't actually paid too much attention to Polyvore before, but. I love this. They show all sorts of, I mean, from decorating for your house to decorating an outfit. Uh, because even, some of y'all be putting together weird uh, shit. <laughs> some of you be putting together some weird shit. Now, like this, I, I just, I'm not even feeling this. Maybe if you're just going to sit around the house. Otherwise, don't go out just this. Don't, don't do that. I would do that for a workout outfit, but I would not wear the shorts long just by day. themselves. Yes, sure. I would, put, yeah. I would put on some long tights even underneath those shorts. That would mm -hmm. Why is this shirt suddenly so popular? <laughs> because Star Wars. Star Wars. I do, I do like the skirt set right here. This is totally my yeah. style right there. I need me some fishnet pantyhose. I wouldn't wear the I wouldn't wear the New Balance, but I put on some some heels, and then I have me some fishnets under my. Um, I love me some New Balance. Mine are hot pink. I love me some some fishnets underneath my skirt. That's what I need. I need to find somewhere that sells those fucking. Clips. Can that even I, hold your hair? Because they used to break my and breaking there, my hair. There's, there's only one that can, and this thing was a fucking monster, and I have broken it, and I need a replacement. I used it when I was dyeing my hair, and I did something to it and broke it. The dye broke it. Probably my hair is red. No, I, no, I'm, I no, it. I'm serious. I'm serious. The serious? dye broke it. Yeah, because when my oh, hair wow. used to be long, and I would dye it every time I put dye in my hair. If I put that on, it was the chemical would do something to the plastic, and it was you snap. know, I never thought about that. You can be very well right. Huh. And look at my hair is growing out again. Ginger been laughing at me. Oh, I went and got mine chopped off the other day. The lady was like, Really? You want that much cut off? Because it was like past the middle of my back. It was working down towards my jeans top. And I was like, Yeah, it's going to go. too hot this I, summer. I, I, I don't know what I'm going to do when I get back to that long. I may go in there and look like, No. Oh, no I no. loved it on one hand, but my hair is so thick. And it's just one of those, I can't. I can't deal with this anymore. I got I got shit to do. I don't have time to be straightening my hair. Two hours. I time myself two hours to straighten my hair. No, fuck that bullshit. <laughs> That's about the time it takes me. Mm -hmm. And even even while it's short, it's taking me takes me two hours. So, Ginger, I'm welcoming back to the. I'm not quite in the long hair club. I'm the medium hair club now. <laughs> yes, my, mine's right below my shoulders now, and I love it. I love it. It's yes, it's red and it's pink. <laughs> And in case y'all don't know, Ginger was laughing at me because yesterday I slapped myself. <laughs> how the hell, I was wondering, how the hell did you slap yourself? I, mean, I sleep, I usually sleep on my stomach. And since it's been growing out, usually I have actually put, you know, I actually have enough to do a ponytail. So I usually am pulling it back. Just a little, little short ponytail. But I didn't because I was just tired and I fell asleep and then the hair fell, you know, over my, over my cheek. And of course, as I'm moving, it was brushing my cheek and I went, oh, something's on me. And bam, I, I really uh, just, that was one of those. I was surprised I didn't have a handprint this morning and slap. So I was like, oh my God. <gasps> I, I got popped into watching a scary movie inside Second Life the other day. No, no. I don't do scary movies as is. Yeah, one of my hairs was inside my shirt, like inside the, the arm. Oh, I hate when they fall. it decided right about that time to move, about the same time there was scary part. Oh my God. Ah! Uh oh, I was flipping the fuck out. I was like, what the hell's on me? Oh my god. And I'm screaming and I'm on the mic and everybody's like, what's wrong with you? Something bite me, something bite me. Oh, go back to the C3PO. Go back to the C3PO. Go back. Oh, yes. I know, right? That is hot. Yes. I really like that. I that really, is... And I really like the Han Solo one too. I, I like that one too. I like the right one. Well, uh, let me get back to you on that right one. Uh, but I like the C3PO and the Han Solo. That's nice. And I like that leather Star Wars. I have that shirt too. I don't have those that pants. Is, that is really, I really like the Ray. The Ray. I'm going to get awesome. back to you on that I like one. Those pants. I'm going to get back to you on that one. I don't know about that one. Boba Fett. Now, this nice. R2D2 people stop. Don't wear these dresses. These are <sighs> not like and, that. Unless you're a kid. If you're a kid, if you're under the age of 10, you can wear these. There is a way to wear it. And I wish I could find the outfit. There is an out. There's a way to wear that. That's gorgeous. See, this, this made That's me think it. of you. The, the tight skirt and the loose oh, sweater. Oh, and yes. The heels. Yes. That is me right there. That's mm -hmm. what I'm talking about. Yes. Let's see, yeah, Look I know my purse. Corey. I know my Corey. Yes, you do. Look at that purse. Did you see the purse? I know, right? The purse is sick. I love it. Oh. The baby purse. Oh, my God. Can we buy that stuff? Do they got it for sale? <laughs> actually, a lot of these, Um, what I love about Polyvore, actually, 
is when you click and you go to the picture, it'll tell you where you can buy this. No, no, I want to see the. I want to see the, the. I want to see the R two D two purse. R two D two. Okay, let me let this. That one right there. No, 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 no. The next one. There you go. There. No, no, no. The one next to it. Hold on. Oh, hold on. R two D two. Well, it was right next this to that. One? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's yeah. BB. That's BB. That's not R two D two. Oh, is that BB? I can't see it because it's so small. <laughs> it's BB eight. All I saw was an eye, and I was like, "It's R two D two. Oh, BB8. yes. Oh, yes, that's a nice price, too. Mm. Yes, and the great thing about Hollywood is the shoes. Get the shoes. Get the shoes. Get the shoes. <gasps> oh. oh, my God. Look at those shoes. Those are fucking hot. Oh. And like it tells you right now that the sweater's on sale, it's usually $80. It's 32 right now. Yes, yeah, because it's about to be hot. Mm. I need this whole outfit. This is where the skirt is from. Oh, oh, it love it. It's so tight. It's a pencil skirt. I oh. know, uh, right? Oh. I love this about Polygon. And if you sign up, you can actually, you know, mark it so it'll email you and let you know when these things that you want are on sale. Mm -mm -mm. Yes. <laughs> oh. oh, my God. To that whole outfit right there. That I would wear on a first date and just fuck up some geek's fuck, head. Yeah, some geek guy would just be... <laughs> yeah, he, he'd have to change his pants and come back because... He would turn into a gay man and be like, Bitch, is that Darth Vader on your skirt? Work? <laughs> I love it. I love it. I really, I do. I, I love me some polymorphs so much. Oh, man. I love all of these Kendra, Stop trying to get me hooked on this. Don't get me hooked. Look at them peach pumps over there. Are you kidding me? With these ones right here? Oh, yes. Oh. Yeah. So sexy. I'm just, how about some Kylo Ren? I really, I really like this Kylo Ren. I like the bracelet. All that black and just one little pop of color. Oh, mm -hmm. look at this, look at the jacket. I want, oh, mm, stop it. I know, right? That jacket how much is that jacket? Is... How much is that jacket? Uh, it doesn't say right now. Harrods, huh? Harrods? Let me open up the link that it has, because it will actually take me, it should take me. Right to it. Oh, it's, it's out of stock right now. Damn it, son of a bitch. <laughs> They're, oh, but they still got other ones that are similar. Pass off. That's $3.99. All right. Right. But it would be worth it. Mm -hmm. I love these coats now that peek out with the arms peeking out like that. I, I do love too. It. I really like it. They're like a I'm very just, new take on a shawl that, you know, your, your yes, nana used to back in the day. Yes. Very new. Yes. And I always hated shawls because. One big piece, you lift them up, and then every piece of you is cold. Just, yeah, oh. see, I like that because just my arms peek out, and when I'm done, I pull them back in. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I really like that. And like this one, I want to say has a zipper. So, say you don't want your arms to get cold, you just keep them bitches inside, zip that up. Yeah, that's a zipper. Oh, right oh there. can you zip from inside? Is what I want to know. Can I pull my arms in? No. And see? Is it fleece? It looks like it says it's fleece. Fleece. That is nice. Yeah, so at least the collar. Oh, so it's the wool mix with a fleece collar. Mm -mm -mm. Still, that's, and that's not and it's got it's pockets. Simple. Yeah, and it's got pockets. Regular fit, dry clean. Oh, it's got a little wool in it, so it's a little warm. Yep. Mm -hmm. that, that right there is the gorgeous. Back. I like Close the buttons. The Ginger, is your mind working? <laughs> right. Yeah. right? Mm. That way I wouldn't have to fucking wring the arms. Well, I might <laughs> See, right there, genius. Uh, <laughs> genius. Genius. That is genius in the making, right there, people. Uh, I like this whole outfit here, too. That I is do, something that too. I would wear with a slouchy hat because I have to have a hat in the winter or a wig, one of the two. Um, <laughs> I'm going to be wearing a wig this coming this winter i'm wearing a wig because my size of my head is shaved so it's gonna be cold oh my god go ahead and click on that right there uh, no no to the left to the left of it to the left right nope. yes go on and click on that go on and click on that the star wars needs del pozo oh i need to okay. see it i need to I see it sure I, was clicking on the right one. I need to see a oh, lamar close to the screen oh yeah what the hell is that Hairbrush, Star Wars. I want no damn hairbrush. I can't show that off. I know, right? <laughs> the fuck I want hairbrush from. Okay, I do not like that. 
but those pants and the shoes are epic. <laughs> those are pretty amazing. I can't imagine ever wearing that. That's just too, too I would. loud. You, well, you know me. I, oh, I want yeah, loud. Be all over that. Mm -hmm. I like them loud. You see my big blue shoes. Yeah, my shoes, the big old, my shoes, the big old blue flower on it. <laughs> Every time I show it to people that work, they're like, you wear those? I say, hell yeah, I do. <laughs> I may be busted from the ankle up, but I will have those shoes on. Oh, because... see, here we go. Oh, holy shit, you do not want that jacket. $4,200. $4, oh, it's Moda. Oh, Cassie, who made it. Moda mm -hmm. Operandi, that's why. Uh huh. 440 for the pants, 13 for the shoes. No, I believe I can. I believe I can find those pants for a little cheaper. I know where the wholesale district is mm -hmm. in Houston. I can get them pants for about $10. <laughs> no, no. Yeah, that would be much nicer. That would be much nicer. I, I just I love this because they already have it all paired for you. So say you oh my god, I love this. I love this right there. They have some of those at Target. Like a whole bunch of different yeah, they have some of those at Target. So we, oh we don't gosh. have that one. Yeah, yeah, that's about right. Well, there's from uh, direct, but it's about the same price at Target. And at Target, I don't know if they have them now, but they probably should. Uh they have the sweatshirts. Because we have a sweatshirt, you know, the Darth Vader mm -hmm. sweatshirt. You have a Star Wars T-shirt. They have uh, all pretty much all the characters. I don't see, any, I didn't see any BB-8 stuff, but I haven't been back on that side yet. Target is really starting to yeah. embrace the geek. I mean, really, them and Walmart. I will give Walmart credit. I see a lot of geeky stuff in Walmart now, but Target really, you know, some uh, some of the yeah. um, the better made geeky stuff is mm -hmm. really great in Target, especially in the women's section. Um, they even we noticed, took them a while, have Minecraft shirts for the girls now, for the little oh girls. Oh my goodness, good, good, it good. Some of the time it's been in the boys section and never been for the yeah, girls. That's, yeah, that's where we had to buy uh, yeah. teenage shirts. But now they actually have some for the girls. So go check out Target, your local Target. Or mm -hmm. sec check out several Targets. They all have different stuff now, too. No, I like, love this. I really do. And I, I minus some of this, because some of this is way too teen looking. Like, I couldn't deal with the, the backpack. But the shirt, the jeans, the jacket, the boots, and I would totally pair it with my uh, bag of holding that I got from Think Geek. That yes, they have. Mm -hmm. I, I get, like if I get because that thing is heavy, I end up half the time wearing it like over, like across me as like a mm -hmm. bag bag, not like a purse. <laughs> it's so huge, but I can fit everything in it. <laughs> yeah, my little uh, purse is just being abused. I am. In the loves with uh with some pants. Oh, here's here's, here's you know, some more pants. There you go, Corey. How much they want for those ones? Two thirty-five. We're coming down. We're coming down. I love how they say super skinny. Nobody is gonna look skinny in shiny pants. That's just not mm -hmm. possible. Mm -mm. Look at the BB-8 outfit. No, 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 go back. BB-8. Let me see the BB-8 outfit. Oh, that is cute. Because I was looking at them pumps earlier. Oh, yes. $26 from Lulu's.com. That's not bad. It's, uh, oh, that's a coat. Is that a blazer? Oh, oh. Oh, it's a blazer. Oh, I thought it was a skirt. A skirt. Oh, my God. Now I want it. Now I really want it. <laughs> it's so bad. I want it. Oh, my God. Latori, nice dress. Nice. Mm -hmm. I want that whole outfit and the purse because it's nothing without the purse. You can dress in the colors, but unless you got the purse, oh. That, that coin purse, $18. Yes, yes from Amazon.com. Oh. I know, right? Mm -mm -mm. I, I love that. I love that. I would so rock that. You know, the most people see this wouldn't even think twice. They wouldn't even put the BBA together until they see the coin purse. That that's why I said you'd have to have the purse to pull it the look together because then people would look at you mm -hmm. and go, oh, "Is that a BB? Oh, you your whole oh my god, your outfit is so yes, cool." Exactly. But like, yes, I know. Do you know what? Oh. I bet you could make that jacket fairly easily yourself. I want that jacket to wear for like in the real world. The whole outfit I need to. Oh, yeah, I, I was talking about real world. I think I saw this pattern at uh, the pattern shop last time we were there. Actually, girl, I cannot sew yet. Yet, no. I have to go someone else for sewing because it's gonna it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen because uh, I've been pricing me a sewing machine, but not <laughs> yet. I'm gonna learn one day. I'm gonna roll out with me a BB-8. Yes. Oh my god. Oh. So this is sort of a geek look, 
and I saw it, and I, I get where they're going with it. They got the big chunky glasses, and they've got the high waisted skirt. I don't know about the hat. I really don't know about the hat. I'm sure the hat can be pulled off. But... I don't like the hat with the skirt. Is what's throwing me. Yeah. If yeah, she did yeah. some, if she pulled the shirt out and it was kind of loose, and she did some leggings and kept the glasses and a hat, I'm good. It's, okay. It, it, All the, right. the skirt messes it up. Yeah. I could uh, yeah, I think you're right too. It almost feels a little forced hipster, like you're trying to do hipster, yeah. but you don't actually. Yeah, and you're not you're not quite there, so I could not do it. That is a hell to the gnaw right there. What is that? Uh, this is supposed to be. Well, it's spacey. It's got a nebula on it. It's an infinity scarf. It so I'm guessing it's not actually a, a top. It's actually just a scarf. But it could. I guess it could work. But you'd have to have on all black. You could not yes. wear this with any other color. I think anyway to make it look good. I'm talking and I all. People are, people are trying to go really, really geeky, and they're like, "Hey, let's put galaxy stuff on it and make it cool." No, no, I mean, no. no. <laughs> No, we're going to keep that to ourselves. I love these outfits so much. When I was a teenager, I wish I'd had these. I've worn the fuck out of them. Girl, you and me both. That one on the right, that blue? Uh, yes, the blue. Hell yeah. Because I, I had a pair blue. of pants. I did like that myself at once upon a time, or I had yeah. drawn all down one leg. Oh, mm -hmm. my God. I was all into, like, I'm going to date myself de la soul, and it, everything was like that. <laughs> everything. And I'd have the glasses on from the middle one, the hat, the earrings from the right one. I may throw that necklace on from the left mm -hmm. <laughs> just to mix it all up. And all the bangles. The bangles. Yes. All the, every single one of them, bitch. They don't even match yeah. anything I got on. I just got them <laughs> on. Oh, my goodness. And this is not technically geeky besides just the glasses. But I really. It is, I, it is a kind of geeky. It's kind of librarian geek chic kind of thing. Yes. Yes, I really liked it. I like the bows. I like the little rings. The shoes. Girls, like it doesn't have to always be high heels. They're, they're, there is they look very like they got a low them. heel, too. Just a very low heel. Yeah. I'm starting to re-embrace the flats, uh, and I was really re-embracing. Okay, wait a minute. Let me. And I have no pictures to show y'all. I just want to let y'all know. At Ross is having their clearance sale. Okay. <gasps> oh, now, yeah? Now, wait. They have mixed in the clearance stuff with the new stuff that came in. And so I went there. I have, I, yes, I have a thing for jumpsuits. I love them. Remember, I'm still in my jumpsuit phase. Remember, I kept telling you that, Ginger, I was going to get me one. Mm -hmm. I got me one. Calvin awesome. Klein. Calvin Klein. Ooh, very nice. Wait, let me really, let me hurt y'all's feelings. It was originally $130. I got it for $20. Fuck yeah, that's hot. I was thought I, I thought I was too cute last week, honey. I bet you were too. We need some photos. We need some photos. <laughs> I'm gonna have to get dressed up again. And I want to tell y'all, I have no pictures of this either, and I'm scared to put up pictures because it keeps messing up my sound. You know how they have those makeup apps on the app store that you can put makeup on? Mm -hmm. Just see what it looks like. I will take a selfie at some point, probably Sunday, because that's when I'm actually off and able to play around with it. And I was trying on the, the, the L'Oreal app, putting on makeup. Now I know what I look like with fake lashes. Now I got to have me some. <laughs> I was trying that. on. It was so cool. Uh, I did. I had never tried it before. I've heard the you know the makeup because you have makeup geeks too. Uh, mm -hmm. That were going on about those apps, and you know you should try it. You should try it. And I just grabbed one last night and you know, had it scan my face and I enjoyed that because also I didn't have to buy it and then try it and be like, this don't work. You know, <laughs> I was able to see, I was able to see right away. This is good. Especially when I had the eyelashes. Oh, I was like, Oh, I got to do some selfies. I don't even take selfies. I'm going to take some selfies. I look so cute. Look at these yeah, lashes. You look so cute, I bet. Aww. I look so cute with these lashes. Oh my God. I'm so cute. I, can't, I was up last night. I can't stand myself. <laughs> Is this a dress shirt? I don't know, but it would be if I wore it. Kind of looks that way. I mean, because you don't see pants in this, but you see the sandals and. It says. I think I'd probably still wear some light tights or something. I love sandals like that, but I cannot wear them. I need the ones that have the thing that go between the toes. I can't. I can't. I can't, I can't, can't. wear the thing between the toes, but it has no arch support. Is where I can't wear it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. I would die, but I like that whole outfit. Really? Really? I had, I had to show you this. I had to show you this. Look really? at that, cute. 
it's like it's a cute baby. I need one that's I need one that says obtuse baby just to throw people off. Oh my god. <laughs> oh this reality sucks sometimes. I miss True books. Story. I know, right? I know I'm getting in that mood again. I need to find me a good series. If any of y'all know of a good series, I kind of like it when, you know, it's the girl lead. You know, I like some sci-fi, some fantasy, that whole thing. You don't like horror, though, right? No, 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 no horror. No horror. See, I want to tell you it's not really horror, and you want to read it because the movie's going to be out in, in next year. The Dark Tower, the Stephen King, where you have Idris Elba and Matthew McConaughey. Uh, nope. I've, I've tried to read. I've tried to read some of his books before. I just I can't. They scare you. My imagination takes off. I don't. It's not so much that I sit there and read. When I read, it's like a movie playing in my head, and I'm and I'm in it, and I can't, you know, no, because then it gets into my nightmares. Well, see, Dark Tower is not that. It's not a. It's not a horror. It is a whole lot of sci-fi fantasy. The okay. only thing that will throw you off is, is the way that Stephen King writes, which is why people think he's a genius, and he is. I love you, Stephen. Is he'll take other stories and tie them all in. All of them are somehow connected to Dark Tower. Uh, let me give you all a quick lesson. So the movie Carrie, Christine, It, um, and there's another one that came out. Oh, God, I can't think of the name of it. And it was a miniseries on TV. But all of them tie. Oh, and the movie The Mist all tie into the Dark Tower. Now, you don't have to read them to to uh to follow just that particular series but if you do manage to pick up one or two of those stories and it ties in it's almost like a cameo in a movie it's almost like when you see uh what's his face in a marvel movie <laughs> you're like oh, oh yeah yeah you're like oh my god this tied into the dark tower this is why this happened oh my god yeah so but if you get a chance ginger grab them and just read them i think it's like 15 books and it's not all it's not that horror kind of scary like you know some of his other books but it is it it will give you the the that janglies because of the way he writes, um, and I I will give this away in case you don't read those of you who are reading it turn away from the podcast. He is a Stephen King's a huge 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 uh, J.K. Rowling fan, mm -hmm. so he wrote Harry Potter into the Dark Tower series. <gasps> Really? And see, yes, and oh exactly God. the reaction that you had was what I had when I saw it. And it's just a paragraph, but it was enough to make me go, oh, is this my geek world? Oh, oh my God, that is so cool. <laughs> uh, so be looking for that one. I think that's around book six. Uh, but so yeah, God, you you have to read them before the movie comes out. And uh, I, I know some people were complaining Idris Elba is not the right race, but I'm actually, I was complaining too, because clearly I think the role should have gone to Clint Eastwood's son, because that's who they characters described as looking like in the movie but I'm actually not unhappy with Idris Elba and I absolutely love Matthew McConaughey especially being a bad guy it's gonna be awesome if they do it right please don't mess up my favorite <laughs> of all time please don't See, that's, that's the bad part with turning so many books into movies now is that they keep fucking shit up well they've always fucked his up oh, I th only two movies out of three out of all his books have come out right uh, I'm sorry, four. I haven't seen The Shining yet. Sorry, y'all. Uh, Christine, the original Carrie, not that new crap they put out. And uh, what was the other one? Might have been The Mist, maybe. The Mist was good. Very nice adaptation. I didn't watch it that one, don't don't read The Mist. I'm going to tell you now, Ginger, don't read The Mist. Okay, I, I, I one, won't read The Mist. That one, The Mist, that one is going to scare the hell out of you. You will be calling me, cussing me out. Do not, just stay away from it. Don't watch the movie because the movie <laughs> is just as scary. Just don't do it. Run away. All right. Okay. What, what we got here? What we got here? What we got here? Uh, I was just flipping through. This is kind of gothic geek. I like that. You don't like it or you do? I said I do. I do. You do. I like the head shave. You know what? I'm going to give me some sideburns next time. I need sideburns. I'm not a fan of those eyebrows, though, man. Not a fan of those eyebrows. Well, you know them goth girls like them. So I'm sorry. Well, she's, They're she's not goth anymore. Got, she, what are they called well, now? I you don't know. know. <laughs> well, whatever it is. It just She's already got a, a long face, and that's not helping. That's true. Or maybe she doesn't have a long face, and so maybe it looks like it's long. She's a tiny little thing. She is a tiny little thing. But she's proportionate, so that's good. Mm -hmm. Tiny and mm, I really like her boots. I like, I like boots. the boots. I like the socks that she has on. I like all of that. I would have worn that too back in the day. That is very cool. I don't know. I couldn't do my hair like that. I, and I what, had the choker too. I have a fucking <laughs> mosquito in here. Sorry. You got one too, Bug? Just flew past yes, me. Yes. 
It was flying at one of my screens. I was trying to kill it without, like, killing my screen. Mm-mm-mm. And, of course, this is just random geek jewelry. Deathly Hallows buzzed. Oh. Mm-hmm. You know, we're supposed to be making jewelry. <laughs> Girl, you don't even know. I got to go gotcha. I got to finish. No, I'm talking about in the real world. We're supposed to be making jewelry. <laughs> oh. Oh. You know, I tried that. And my hands got blistered. So fuck that bullshit. <laughs> and I, I just don't have time. You. We're gonna see if I can pull up some stuff. If it's okay. gonna let me. If it's gonna let me. Oh, oh, oh! Did you have to close windows? Uh, no, I had to. Well, uh, not windows itself, but I had to close some windows. Okay. Um, where is my business? Let me see if I can get it to open. Since we we're showing off outfits, I has a cute one. Ha 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 ha! This right here. I would have a lot of windows, but I've already gone through them all. <laughs> well, got a little bit left. How you like that business right there? <gasps> I like that. You know, I'm not usually a fan of any of the Captain. way Captain America's been done. That one I like. That one I like I a it. lot. I just don't think her pants are tight enough, but I love it. Tighten them up, girl. Tighten them up. Or pull eh. that shirt out or something. They, so they look okay, too wrinkly. Pull, pull the shirt out, yeah. Well, I think the pull the shirt out pants need to be just a tad bit tighter because right now they just look wrinkled. Um, that's why I wear tight pants because I don't have to iron them. So, <laughs> good reasoning. Good reasoning. That's how, that's why I wear them. They stretch all the wrinkles out. Hang on, I'm coming back. I'm coming back. Now, here's something that's going to be amazing because we tell y'all we hate dresses like this, but I actually like it. Look at that. That is. I'm not seeing anything. It's coming. It's oh, coming. there it is. <gasps> is that, all right, that one is kind of cool. I like it. There's no negative space and you can actually throw a belt on it or you don't have to throw a belt on it or you could put some uh, hosiery underneath it. No lace, ladies. Solid color, please. Mm-hmm. Yes. No, no prints. You can put a solid color and nothing too brightly colored. Uh, sheer, yeah, sheer. I, I th- yeah, I think I would either go with blue or the green. I go with the very, if, it, if any of those colors are good, but just make it very sheer because it can't pop yes. more than the dress. The dress has no. got to be the showpiece. Yes. Um, and a red head could rock this ginger. I think this is a perfect dress for red. <laughs> yes. This is a red head's dress okay. right here red with red some red. glasses and a pencil in your hair. That's how you rock that. That's geek. <laughs> I did not realize how red my hair was until I stepped out in the sunlight <laughs> the other day. I was like, oh, shit. Combat boots or heels would work with this. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh, yeah. I kind of like that idea. The combat boots. And if you wanted to wear the heels, you can even go so far as arm gloves, those gloves that come all the way up the arms. See how I'm working all that look out for y'all? Yes. Mm-hmm. But you don't really need any jewelry. You could put on some long arm gloves or not. You can have you a nice solid color bag. Oh, a nice bag, if you could find one, would be one shaped like Captain America's shield, just round. But small, understated. It goes under your arm so that nobody sees it until you actually pull it out, just like Cap does. And then, bam! No, bam. fuck yeah. Mm-hmm. Language, language. There's a lot of Captain America. Sorry, places. sorry. Language. <laughs> I'm language. Sorry. We just, we just lost this lo- lost this losers, <laughs> lost this listeners in China. My bad. My language. bad. That's also from uh, Avengers, Captain America. Yes, Kim yes, I know. We, we finally watched the first Avengers. The first, no, the second. It was the second. Okay. Avengers. I need These right. I haven't I haven't watched the first one all the way through. I'm waiting for them to stop charging me for a Comcast, you bitches. Um, these Batman tights I adore. Those are really cool. <laughs> I would normally be like no, but I adore them uh, for around the house and maybe under just a plain white t-shirt. Remember, you can't see. It? Well, see, she has a plain white t-shirt on. That's what I think quite works. I probably wouldn't be showing all this, but hey, this hanging down this way, combat boots, roll out, roll out, yeah. Autobots. Autobots roll out. Um, love with me. Let me go ahead and pin that for y'all. Y'all watching this? Y'all watching this? See how we pin stuff for y'all? Because we love you. Okay, more tights because I'm all into the tights today. Bam, look at that. Deadpool tights, so, bitches. I just watched Deadpool again today. That was so awesome. I have not seen it yet. We are slated to go this Sunday, I hope. Yay, you got to watch it. Oh, it's so awesome. Cannot wait. I don't know if it's true or not. I need to look into it. Uh, whether or not there's going to be an actual. Uh, X-rated one version that's coming out. Un- unrated? I would not be surprised. Um, but in the meanwhile, I need these tights. <laughs> I want to see. <laughs> I wish I could get the tights. Oh, hot. Y'all rated. I want to. <laughs> mm. 
this is she's like hmm, I need to see. now this is how you wear your star wars stuff this is actually not bad together not so bad. i actually like that usually i say don't mix but that mixed very well it mixes because this is big and then these are big okay. they're not teeny well and, and it might work tiny but you got to have some kind of balance this balances out very well uh, this is another one good with heels or combat boots. Girls, going out with your geek boys, just do it up. Mm -hmm. This right here, you could dress it up at night like uh, the the cake, the jacket Ginger was showing earlier that are the cake kind. Mm -hmm. You put that on, and then when you get to the restaurant, you take it off. You got on your Star Wars short shirt. You got a necklace. Yeah. You got on some bracelets you can do. Your hair, put your makeup if you like the makeups. Uh, and if you don't like the makeups, lip gloss. Nude lip gloss does wonders. Make you look like you got on a whole bunch of makeup and you don't. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I do it all the time. I go outside. That's why I say I put on lip gloss and they're like, hey. It's like, hi. You're wearing makeup today? Not really. Yeah, it's okay. Uh, but yeah, because this one's good. And that $85. Is, good. But oh, out of stock. But it's a black for, for the entire outfit? It, oh, well, the, it's oh, just the leggings. Okay. Yeah. It, yeah, black milk. Oh, it's from Black Milk. Oh, okay. All right. Mm -mm -mm. Somebody says. Somebody says. I don't know whether to pin this to my fashion or my nerd board. That's why we need a fashion nerd. That's what we yes. are. Fashion nerd. fashion nerds. Yes. Uh, this I actually like. Fashion nerdistas. <laughs> I love this right here. That is really cute. This is a Harry Potter, the chapter one of the book dress. I would throw a belt on it. A big old belt right here. Because mm -hmm. you just need a big old, it just looks like it's craving a big belt. I know it covers up the words, but people are going to ask you what it says anyway. Most of them, yeah, are yeah, and the way it's pleated anyway, you're going to have a hard time. So, yeah, so I need a, need a belt, need a belt. Oh, uh, I love red. Oh, girl, red would off. That would be oh, nice. Yeah. That would be nice. Just, mm -hmm. and, and I need it cinched just tight. I can't breathe tight. No, <laughs> <laughs> I have a belt like that. And then I think I have killed that poor belt. It sees oh. me coming in, it screams. It's like, no, no, send me anymore, mommy. Stop, <laughs> stop. Okay, let me skip down here. Aha. Okay. No, 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 no. I don't like this part. Okay, this right here. From here down, I'm okay. It cannot have any of this business at the top. Just plain white. It's fine. Mm -hmm. And maybe a black here. Or maybe pick up this red. Or maybe it's white. But y'all have to stop it. Yeah, that, yeah. That, mm -mm, it's not cute. It, it, it needs to be done a different way. And I need some sparkle or something. You know, I'm going to come off this. I can't say it. I can't do it. I'm trying. I'm really trying. It's not working <laughs> out. I'm trying. I'm trying. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Okay, since I, cause I do have another one I can share. I think I have lost. Yeah, okay, I do like these right here too, by the way. Okay, continue. I'm going to jump off because I got to scroll okay. down some more. This, I really really like this outfit right here national mm -hmm. graphic shirt they've cut off the sleeve I, tucked into that's kind of awesome it's amazing i kind of want to make it that is hot i love it it's, she just needs more waist more it needs more belt at the waist or something it needs yeah. to thicken up but otherwise i love it i love it scroll it's, down let me get look at the shoes too oh girl work i know right I really that is hair. and that i love is, i love that her lipstick matches Yes, and everybody can't pull off that color red on the lips. Just tell y'all now, mm -hmm. and it's it's matte. Oh, it's pretty. It is. It is. It looks like her nails match even. So totally. I'm I cool. really like this. Yes, I like this. Going on a going on a date, going out with friends, just going out for the day. Whatever. And you know what? You know what else I like about it? It's kind of ageless. Okay. You yes. know, the hair, the hair would change it. This is going to be for somebody yeah, 30s, 40s could pull this one off. If you were a little bit younger, you could even go with a ponytail, high or low. Mm -hmm. um, I would change up. Really nothing other than the hair. The hair would probably change the age. Look, but it's really timeless. Really, really is. Any age really could wear is. this. Mm hmm. I love it. I love it. So say you're a school teacher. Great one right there. But though they probably make you want to have sleeves because school Well they could throw on a jacket if they were a teacher. Yeah. Just oh yeah, okay, on. okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Just cover true. cover up the arms and then pull the hair up, you know, the little chignon. Mm -hmm. I love a pencil in the hair. I don't know why. Girl, do you know I almost lost my apple pencil? <gasps> don't I, lose your apple pencil. I had it in my hair and I forgot. So I'm going outside. 
you know, and it's all pinned up. And then I, I usually, you know, my hair is looking real crazy. And I realized it was looking crazy, but it was, you know, but I forgot I had the pencil in it and put on, went to put on a hat and it tumbled out. I was like, the fuck is that? <gasps> that is an apple pencil. Oh my God. No, don't lose the apple pencil. We cannot lose that shirt. Apple. Made me think of you. <laughs> Life's a struggle when you're a muggle. I'm not a muggle. <laughs> I'm not a muggle. Oh, but I can totally see you wearing this for some reason. That's just hilarious. I'm not a muggle. I hate fucking dinosaurs, but apparently they're in right so now. They're so cute. Did you see the little person that it ate? <laughs> uh, oh, my God. There's a little person. Oh, my God. <laughs> I said, I'm buying that for you. I'm buying that for you. Don't you do it. Yes. fucking dinosaurs. <laughs> but he's so cute. No. No, dinosaurs are not cute. They're reptiles. They're big. They eat people. They don't exist anymore. <laughs> I, I really, I, I like the Doctor Who look. I really do. I'm they so are really coming that. out with some nice stuff with Doctor Who finally because we've been seeing, we were seeing some stuff that was like, mm mm. Because even that bag's not bad. And, and I like that the, the outfit doesn't just scream, but together with the, the bag, it. I like it. I like it. I like it. Um, because Easter's coming up, and I'm just having fun at this point. Look at these eggs. I may have to try to do these eggs. Are those jelly? Oh, they're just regular eggs. That's so Regular cute. eggs. Regular eggs. Yeah, teenagers would cut me if I did those. She doesn't. You know, she would want to do them herself, yeah. <laughs> that would be a problem. I would love to see what she would make. I'm not going to mention it because I don't feel like boiling eggs and having those in my refrigerator looking at me. You know, there's nothing like deciding I need me a snack. You know, I need a little protein and open it up and Boba Fett is looking at you. That's not that's not going to be fun. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the boiled egg you're looking for. <laughs> this is not the egg salad you're looking for. Yeah. Don't think I'll tell I'm going to make, make egg salad. Big old dork. Yes. Um, I'm out of things again. Do you have something? Wait, well, yes, yeah, I, I do. Because I found okay. my other thing, my other love Pencil skirts. Pencil skirts. Oh, let me see. Let me see. See, this is one of their little geek looks. Oh, see, that's hot. That I that's love. not even, that, that's just fucking hot, yo. Right. I am in love with this. That is. Mm. Hey, geek boy, you need to bend me over this chair right about now. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, ma'am. Uh, no, ma'am. I don't know what this is, if it's a headband. The mustache. Yeah, I can't tell what it is. I don't really care. I'm going to use it anyway somehow. Uh, but I love it. I love it. I love the shoes. They might have a little heel on them or they might be flat. Uh, and I don't generally like pointed toe shoes, but it just works with all this. It totally works with all this. Um, I, I, I love it. I really do. Wait a minute. Am I on the page with the mouse? The right mouse? Okay, yeah, I am. All right. Then this is another. Where's my other? Okay, so we got all these from the um, from the Avengers. We might have shown this before, but I can't remember. So there's Thor, which is okay. Yeah, Thor is okay. I, I like Loki a lot. I like Loki a lot. Loki. Captain America? No, no. Just no. I like Captain America. Really? I'm not feeling it. Not I feeling it love, at all. I love it. I'm loving it. Uh, maybe not the earrings. but the And I don't know what that's supposed to be. Maybe they just have it there. But I'm really here for it. I like Iron Man's too. Look at them. Look at them. I especially love the glasses. I almost bought these glasses in Target. Uh, Iron Man is Iron Man's okay. I don't know about I don't, I'm kind of iffy on the shoes. I like these kind of heels. I saw somebody with them on the other day and I said they're not so bad, but I don't know about this color. Kinda. I like those kind of heels because you don't fall. Don't fall. <laughs> they support you. I, I wore the chunky heels a lot when I was working in the pharmacy. Amen. You and me both. Not when I, I didn't work at a pharmacy. Um, <laughs> I'm not feeling this Hulk at all. Uh-uh. I'm not either. I'm, I don't know what the hell y'all were doing there, but it's... He's not working. Mm -mm. Black Widow, love it. Love it. Look at the heels. Look at it. See, they look different. Oh, in that those, color. those are hot. Yes. The pants are leather. I'm all about some leather and shine. Yes. So is that a belt or a bracelet? I can't tell. I think this is a, I think this is a belt because I can see a okay. couple of loops in there. Um, Hawkeye, love it. Really Brace. like that. I don't know if this is a bracelet or a belt right here. Either way, I'm wearing it. <laughs> it's probably a bracelet. It, it looks more like me a bracelet. I think that Hawkeye had a family. I was just like, whoa. Ah, uh, yeah, I did not know. 
that hurt me. I was hoping him and Widow would get together. I don't really like I her. Know. You know what? I don't like the I I like that actor, but I don't like him as the Hulk. Mm-mm. I Mm-mm. think the perfect Hulk was um what's his face? Edward Norton. And I really wish he'd came back. Um, he had just enough calm and just enough crazy that I, I loved it. He didn't look like tormented Hulk. Yeah, and th- that's really what I got from that was that Hulk was just very, very tormented. And I was just like, I don't know about this. And Edward Norton at the end of his tenure as the Hulk, when he's about to change and he looks at the camera, it's like, I'm about to fuck you up and I like it. <laughs> uh, I was like, yeah, I love Edward Norton. Where has he been? Edward, where have you been? Okay. <laughs> you let us down. Oh, you. well, we have gone over now. Yeah, we have gone. We are out of time. We will see you Thursday for more news. And the next week we'll be back with more geeky stuff. Yay. More geek, oh more my geeky God. stuff. We did not I, even get to fashion week stuff at I all. I need, I need to share one thing with you really quick. What? Oh, do we need to go off the air before you share? No, 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 look. Wait a minute. Let me stop sharing. Let me stop. Let me stop. <laughs> Girl, all right. <laughs> I thought you get kicked out of that because I know how much you go, love Buffy. So. Yeah, you're going to make me go watch some episodes of Buffy. I'm going to have to hunt them down. It's oh. on Netflix if you have Netflix. They're on um, Comcast. I just have to hunt for them. They're so uh-huh. hard to find stuff. So uh-huh. hard. Well, I won't have all the episodes. So you have all of them. I'll have like a few of the popular ones. Yeah, I'm kind of feeling a Buffy, Buffy thing coming back on. Watch them all. Did you even watch Buffy? Yeah, well, not not when it was on, but no, but I have watched it since, yes. Uh, At least twice now. All of them? Mm-hmm. See, you've been holding out on me. You've been holding out, Ginger. <laughs> I watched them all late nights working on Mesh. Turn that on and watch it, yeah. You have been holding out on me because, oh, we had <laughs> guts, okay? We had I guts. Yes, yes. This is what Netflix. This is what this is what Netflix does. It brings people together. Okay, we out of here, peoples. We will see y'all next week. Yep, yep. If we survived the great flood. 